because we have news coming in that suspected terrorists have shot dead a woman special police officer that is the SPO in Shopian. Uh, Nazir, first and foremost, uh, uh, have these assailants been found, been caught? Is the search on underway for them? It, and it seems I have very little details coming in, Nazir, but it seems from what I've heard or understood so far to be quite a brazen attack because she was killed right outside her home. Yeah, exactly, sir. A very, very brazen incident. A woman, a special police official, who had joined Jammu and Kashmir police. It's a temporary, you know, job for anyone who can volunteer to join Jammu and Kashmir police on monthly stipend of 5,000 or 6,000 rupees. But our source tell us that she was from a very poor family. A year back, she joined Jammu and Kashmir police as special police official. And the, today, this afternoon, you know, she, uh, the gunmen actually, but police are saying militants, they surfaced there outside her home and they resorted to heavy firing and she was shifted to hostel in a very critical condition while she was declared broad dead. Uh, individuals, we can also see how her father is actually crying bitterly, how, you know, uh, his, his only breadwinner has been killed. And this is at least third or fourth incident when the uh, people, defenseless people have been killed in South Kashmir in the last four days. Yesterday, one, uh, you know, civilian, Manzoor Ahmed Lone, was shot dead outside his home. Therefore, yesterday, a National Conference block president was shot at and injured in Bijbihara. And, and last few days back, a, a former army recruit was also killed outside his home in Pulwama. So there have been series of incidents as you know, the state is preparing for the parliament elections. And also there's talk about holding up the somebody elections as well. But it is these innocent people, it is these defenseless people who become the target of these this violence. And today, a young woman, as a special police official, woman special police officer, was killed in this senseless violence.